Welcome back. Today we're talking about Still Austin's Bottled and Bond Red Corn Bourbon Whiskey, 100 proof. How will it taste? How will it smell? Will it be worth the MSRP they're asking? Stay tuned and find out. Welcome back. Like I said, today we're talking about Still Austin's Red Corn Bourbon Whiskey. This is their bottled and bond. It's uh, They're going to do like releases like a summer release, a fall release, a spring release. So four times a year. This is the summer 23. This is 100 proof, like I said. And the back says, the whiskeys in our seasonal bottled and bond series capture the ingredients, flavors, and themes of the seasons. From this summer release represented by the heat-loving snake and cactus, we combine the robust nuttiness of the Jimmy Red Corn with a sweet spice of rye. The results are hearty summertime bourbon offering creamsicle, black tea scents, followed by the playful palate of peppermint and marzipan. Enjoy, and enjoy responsibly. I got into Still Austin when I went down to visit my daughter, who lives in Houston. And I saw it, and a lot of people raved about it, and it was just starting to kind of creep in three, well, four years ago before the Rona, just starting to creep into people's conscious, especially, excuse me, well, Nancy in the nose, Fraley. Um, she has a keen scent and taste for a lot of them. Like Joseph A. Magnus, still lost in Wyoming. There's a lot that she's really involved in. And she knows her craft. If she says something, people perk their eyes or ears up and listen. It's got a little bit into the history. Got a little bit in the bottle, like I always say. What's the juice like inside? Let's get to our first nose. Oh, I forgot already. The composition is this is 36% Jimmy Red corn, 34% white uh, corn, 70% corn in total, 25% rye, and 5% barley. Not malta, just barley. And it's aged at least four years. Sorry about that. Of course, being bottled in bond. Now let's get into the nose. Oh, so you get a vanilla, your oak, but I get a cracked pepper. You see, it's got a light amber in color, but she is just like a curtain of glorious happiness there. I've had a little bit out of this the last couple of days. I've had this roughly about two weeks. Got it off of Unicorn, Unicorn Auctions. Believe it or not, shipped. I won this for 60 plus shipping, which was another seven. So 67, which is below MSRP. So there are times on those auctions and, and when you're bidding or you're looking at a, you can get these bottles, believe it or not, a tad bit cheaper than retail, like I did on the last video. Back in the nose. Oh. Fresh nectarines, like when you open up a nectarine, it goes shh, and it kind of sprays out that smell. That's what that's like. And, and a nice, rich red fruit. Got into the nose. Let's get into that taste. First, right off the rip, neck pour I had of this. I loved it. Absolutely loved it. You get a rich baking spice, like baking goods. You get that, that nectarine taste that's on the back, and you get a thick mouth-coating vanilla, an apricot, a little bit of a, like a vanilla maple frosting, like that, like when it's, uh, it's like soupy, when it's like cream, all that. I mean, honestly, again, this is, you know, as you can see, it was here to here. Man, this is good. I mean, if you can, if you can find this where you're at, pick it up. Trust me, you will not you will not be disappointed in this. This is also like they call the dog days of summer. This is a dog days of summer drink. This is just absolutely flipping beautiful. I, if I can find a backup of this, trust me, I'm going to. This is, man, this is just good. Let's get in for a second taste. The second taste, you definitely get your red fruits. Almost like a berry note, like a raspberry, a blackberry. And you get that oak spice. But honestly, like I said before, man, this is good. This is, puts a smile on your face. You know they're doing something good. Still lost in the cask strength. I've had their bourbon. As I liked it, it was good. A little thin for me, but it was good. The cask strength is outstanding. This one here from them is amazing. And my name is Brian. Like I always say, find a bottle, open the bottle, enjoy the bottle. Because this short and sweet video, whiskeys are always meant to be shared. Thank you. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know below if you've had this or any other Still Austin, anything from their uh, direct from the distillery. Let me know. 
like I said, my daughter's not too far from there, so it's a little bit of a drive for her, but for her dad, she'll do it. Thank you so much for watching. I will talk with you all soon.